My friend, my friend, you don't know me. This is on page 620 in the ukulele fate book. Yeah, we're gonna rock it up to the first measure. There are no sharps and flats, which means we're in the key of C major. C major is a minor two, D minor. It has a minor three as E minor, a major four for F major, G major, A minor for the six, B diminished for our seven, and then C again. However, if you take a C major, move through a C major seven, and play a C dominant seven, otherwise known as a C seven, you get the E diminished. <clears throat> Same thing. I'm going to call it a C seven, however, or a dominant five for the purpose of memorization. We also have something called a diminished in here. This is a diminished seven. This works for multiple different chords, but the one we're calling it today is going to be the F sharp diminished seven. It's going to look like a G major, yeah, but you're going to put it horizontally at the pinky on. What you're quite literally doing is you're changing the notation from having something that resolves to another chord. Awesome. Uh, other than that, G7 is going to be in there. We're going to have a D7, which you don't have to play it like a full bar. If you're having a hard time with bar chords, you can play it like this. You're just taking the D major and getting rid of the D, opening it up the C. Thus, you can put your finger down here if you want to. Uh, C major 7, we already kind of discussed when we're going to the C7. And then the only other chord that's out of pocket here that's not in C major is an A. A7. It looks like an A major. We just reveal its dominant seventh G because in the key of A major, you have A, B, C sharp, D, E, F sharp, G sharp. G sharp is the major seventh. So the dominant seventh, the minor seventh is G natural. All right. When we play this song, there's going to be a eighth note lead up. And we're going to say, you give your, and then we're going to go right into the chord. You give your C major to me. And then you say hello. We're going to go to a C7. And I F major, hardly speak, my heart is beating so. Here's our weird F sharp diminished seven. And anyone can tell. C major, A7, you think you know me well. D minor, G7, but you don't know me. C major, uh, right here I would do like a like a C5, C sus4, C, quick D7 to a G7 as a turnaround. No, back to the top. You know the one who dreams of you and I. C7 and longs to kiss your lips and longs to hold you tight. Here's our F sharp seven, diminished seven. To you, I'm just a friend, A7, that's all I've ever been. Take the second ending, ever been, to G7, but you don't know me. C, F, to C, then C7, here's our transition note, E diminished, or C dominant 7, F major, I've never knew the art, C major 7 of making we're gonna move this up by one note by playing these two right here to love to my d minor tuplet a count with g7 love for c you here's an a minor a friend and shy i let it e minor my chance go by d7 and the chance you might have loved G7, me too. Outro verse, you give your C to me, and then you say goodbye. C7, I want you F, walk away beside the lucky guy. F sharp diminished seven, to never, 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 never know the one. Whoever loves you. That D minor, I jumped up to the fifth fret for a tonality. G7, jump all the way up to the seventh fret and bar the eighth on the top. It's a great little ender here. Whoop, whoop, whoop. Back it up to the C major. Hand to me. Well, then you say goodbye. C7. I'll watch you F walk away beside the lucky guy. F sharp diminished seven to C to never, never know the one who loves you so, but you don't know me. C.
end on a seesaw. I hope you had a lot of fun today. I really enjoyed this song. Aloha.